that shit or what the fuck y'all talking about. Oh, I ain't wait, going wait, for what that. You, what oh you felt God. about it? What you felt about it? What you felt about it, Swamp? There was times where like I was like, okay, there's something that women don't get. Then there was sometimes where I was like, okay, nah, that's just some women don't get that. That's just how yeah. I look at it. look at it. At any situation, like I don't it's all constructive criticism. We all learning because like, I feel like you you never gonna learn a woman all the way or figure a woman out because she can't even figure herself out in a certain degree. So like it's always an ongoing oh, that but at the same time, like I don't mind listening and being open about something. Like, it's just the process of a woman actually listening with the intent to listen. Right. And y'all, oh, y'all listening and all that. But, you know, I appreciate y'all. Shout out to the whole platform and everything. And y'all got a good thing going here, though. Appreciate it. Actually, somebody asked when the three-on-three three gonna go. I guess he's saying three females. That is go That would be too wild. <laughs> yeah, too much, and it would be too long. It yeah, would be that too, would be... We would have to start one question. We would have to have one question. One question. And, right, right. Um, But uh, this was great. This was amazing. Um, One of the things... uh shook it up which was um you guys i have been advertising like we want you here we're just three women well four women that have opinions and questions and we want I, i'm welcoming men black men preferably uh come up here and uh let us know like we, we're open for conversation i want to talk about it like correct us if we're wrong or um enlighten us but we have i have a spot open for starting next for next Sunday, the 31st, on up until February. If you would like to come up here, if you don't feel comfortable coming up here by yourself, you can grab a buddy, like fill up these squares on this uh this screen. Um but I think I have a guy though for you, Ashley. I think I have perfect, a guy. Perfect, perfect, perfect. But if you want to come up here, um inbox me and um we can make it do what it do. Um Sean, aka Swamp, we really appreciate you. I know. This is a, a conversation piece. People gonna agree, people not gonna agree, but the whole point of it is, is to spark some conversations. What I hope y'all walk away from this with is this dating, like, talk about it. Get an understanding. Could be on the same page, like, so I'm it just, won't be nothing. Women, like, are you dating or exclusive? <laughs> right, right. You don't even have to ask like, that, oh, though. God, like, <laughs> yeah, you really but yeah, you really because if you dating, I'm good. <laughs> I know I'm good. It's <laughs> exclusive dating, uh, maybe because you just talking to one person, seeing where it go or whatever. But like, mm -mm, I don't know about that one, girl. <laughs> but all right, um, we're gonna wrap yep. this up. Um, see y'all next Sunday. Um, thank you guys. Um, and I send y'all the info. If you if you want to come back up here, um, let us know if you got some like if you got some topics that you want to discuss and get women opinion about it, you're more than welcome. You're more than you welcome. Should. Just reach out and then I'll reach out to Whit. Now you can reach out to me, whichever. But you're more than welcome to always come up here. Y'all yeah. have a good night. Bye, you All guys. Right. Hey y'all, uh, watch he go on his live and he's gonna be talking crazy again. <laughs> 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 like, what the fuck? Every time we're talking about he's like, <laughs> he gonna go over his and dismiss everything we don't talk about. Like, no, we just talked about this. <laughs> um my junk gonna be titled, Do we got to accept their terminology of date? Oh my god. <laughs> but but uh, it's your life. It's your life though. It's your dating life. You, date life. Okay. you do how you wanna do. <laughs> but with, all right, man. But go back and read the comments. A lot of women are saying they they dating multiple men at the same yeah, time. I bet, I bet. Uh, and some no, some women say they don't like that because somebody said I'm so shocked that y'all are dating multiple men. But again, I think that goes back because I th I feel like when people say dating, when people hear women are dating multiple men, they say oh they they hey, sleep you know sleeping with John wait. Tom. Let me ask y'all one question. Mm -hmm. So it's okay what that that Lori girl doing. We, have we just talked about that. Oh my gosh, we, we just talked about that. Do y'all think what's it's she okay. doing? What's she doing? Yeah, let's. What? Yeah. yeah. What about, let, let, yeah, let him explain it first. Y'all let me know what y'all stand for. That. No, no. Go ahead. What is it? That is no. a bunch of bull. That's a bunch of bull. <laughs> what's she doing? She was in a relationship with somebody. Did she stop talking to them? And she was in a relationship with somebody else. So what? What's she doing? Is it okay? Right. Now, if you're going to ask us the question about Lori, is it okay what Future does? I don't know. Go ahead. What Lori did? That's what I'm trying to figure out. What Lori did? If it's I, okay. Lori did. It's okay what Future did. 
Is it okay with what Future do? It's different though. That is a woman, man. You didn't caught about ten bodies in the year just started. I ain't want no future. Look, look, I told call, you. call me back, call me back. <laughs> yeah, 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 cause she is screwing the man. Don't think that them are. Oh, you know she is. And, it's yes, a, and I don't just follow nobody. If you getting blown out, you don't know that. You don't know that. You don't. Yeah, yeah, okay. And Ashley brought up something else too in the comment that same conversation that um when I you know when I was messaging you Ashley um. You know, super, super sent. She um has a bad rep too sometimes because she does the same thing. Like she'll start dating a guy and dating somebody else, him. and they always, they always say something negative about her. But for some, for whatever reason, I know Lori has been like the golden child. But super sent was doing the same why. thing, getting so much negative backlash. This though. is why. This is why because Lori is low key with hers. Lori is classy. I don't want to call her a whore, but Lori is what men love, which is uh. Classy in the streets of freaking the sheets. That's what she is. Y'all don't know that. <laughs> Get out that woman's job. Okay. Anyway, Courtney. So <laughs> Super Scent is different. Super Scent is a hood chick. Like Super Scent is hood. Super Scent is ghetto. Oh. Super Scent hop from dick to dick, even though we know Lori do it too. But Lori is classy. Where I'm just telling you, this ain't what I feel. That's I'm the perception of it. That's the perception. Yes, exactly. Exactly. So whenever, first off, like I said, with Michael, I didn't think he even, I thought he, you know, I, I would have yeah. never assumed, yeah. you know. So for him, I think he feel like he caught a bad one because she. Uh, hey, Sean, know? that's, that's why I want to know. So I know, you know, it's the, the whole Lori thing has been, been a conversation. So my question to you is, you talking to somebody, let's say you've been talking to him for, I don't know, let's say eight months, and you thought, you know, everything was going good, for whatever reason, it don't work out. How long do you wait until you talk to somebody else or you pr pursue somebody else? Like, seriously. Bitch, really you ain't had nobody in the clique, because you only talk to one woman at a time. Yeah, right. he ain't got nobody, because he only just right. talks yeah, to he don't, one Yeah, he don't do that. Right. He don't do the multi -day. So what, so what, what? What what's the timeline? Cause that that seems like what is what is going down to. Because it's like if you was talking to somebody for whatever reason it didn't work. So do, does that person like just not pursue anybody else? So what's the what's the timeline for no, you? Put no, I don't put no time, no no exact time limit on it. But I don't want it to be no body like you know like like no Bobby Smurda. She caught a body about a week ago. Like type jump. Yeah. Like. Come on, man. I just seen. Listen. That's why I don't post it. Don't post. Women don't post you mean. And truth be told, these fellas ain't no lame dudes, man. At all, in any way, form, or fashion. What is they're, she talking to? Listen, the dudes that she that she been dating lately, they ain't no lame yeah. dudes. Right, right. They're to that caliber to where you know why they allow her to per, like turn that camera on, kiss on them, and all that. It ain't no publicity stunt or whatever. It's because, like, it ain't just been no, I like going to dinner with you. That kuntnu is very good. I know she got some good snacks by how, like, the dudes don't mind doing it, but they think they the one. Meanwhile, ain't nothing long-term about that girl, man. So you, uh, you, you said something there. So are you saying the men, because she is a desired woman, you think that when she chooses, she's choosing them, they ain't choosing her. And when they, when she do grace them with her presence, uh, they feel like they gonna be the ones that lock her down. You could tell us after that coat known is applied. Okay. I'm gonna be real though. No, you I know, feel like, that's no, what you, I want. That's what no, I mean. Because she even got that evil look like, come here, Michael, take this snap. <laughs> real. Like, come on, bro. Like, and buddy just come over there and kill. So, like, bro, she done lay that coat what, what, down. What their names is? Turtle and, um, I don't know. God, God, I forgot. The shade room posted that nickname. Yeah, they they did. Each other. Damn. But I just, I just feel like, you know, it, I feel like if, I don't know, everybody doesn't have a phase, but, you know, I feel like, let's say if, like, you go back, there, there, you mentioned it before, like, there was a time where it was just like, if somebody would be like, okay, that that's how Tayshawn or Sean was from a while ago. Like, that ain't how I am. Like, I'm about to be 30. Like, I ain't focusing on that right now. I feel like if you compare that to Lori and her state, I feel like it's the same thing. Like she, y'all, she probably not even thinking about. I don't, I don't know. She might not want anything long term. Right I now. feel she like I, I feel like 
at some point you gotta you gotta cherish your temple. Like, how do you think the outside? I know it. It doesn't matter what people may think of you, but it should matter how people view you. They can thank you whatever you want to thank, but you should view them a certain way. Look at how the average mindset probably look at that girl, man. Look how many niggas get near the temple, that sacred place. Y'all call it live best life, finding out and this, that, and, and girl, go with him. Just that. No, man, hell no. No, no. I, I, I personally That's, think But you know, like, uh, another side of it, too, like, while you were speaking on that, it's just like, you know, like, just even when I was asking about, like, what's the time length as you talking to somebody, it doesn't work out before you start pursuing somebody else. Um, I just feel like, you know, dang, that thought just left my head. Well, I'll say this. I want to touch on when he said your body is a temple. Um, oh, that's what it was. I, I think I think possibly she do look at her body as a temple, but she's looking at it as a different perspective, possibly, because like you said, all the guys that she's been attached <laughs> to that we do know about, because I'm pretty sure there's more behind the scenes, you know, that haven't been posted. But she probably looking at it like, I'm not going to be fucking with no lame ass nigga. So, you know, she's like, proud like, of he- the men. That she um that she has been um outed with or whatnot. Yeah, you know. And Swan um, was also saying like earlier he was like you know you know guys out here they'll just hit whatever like they're not interested in cuffing nothing like they just want to hit move on to the next person. And you know when it comes to like even when you just mentioned he just mentioned about you know it's your temple mm-hmm. like I just be wondering sometimes like even though guys say you know it's just different you know it's just different you know different way out our goods our hour hour you know they put a possession on that thing like i feel like guys don't realize like when when they cheat on other people it's just like dang he done stick his thing in whatever 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 and you're just supposed to be like oh well i ain't got no emotional connection i just i just hit i just hit. yeah, yeah. I, I tell guys well, i'm like i don't want no use tying yeah but at the same time it's just like in my mind i'm always thinking like how do guys always want something so sacred but then they want to and then but then they want to enter it with something tainted like you already know even though you didn't want even though you didn't want even though you didn't want to be in a relationship like that ain't what you want i just i just want to you know i just want to do me you know i just want to do whatever hit this hit that like i ain't really trying to vibe with nobody on that level but it's just like now that you know you get serious whatever like when you look at somebody you just mention it like you want somebody who who takes pride in their temple. You want somebody who keeps that sacred. But like, it's just like, I just feel like, like, what? they want something so sacred, but they don't mind tainting it because they've been with this person, that person. You don't mind tainting that, but you want this to keep sacred. This can't be sacred when you've been out sticking this thing and every other thing. When you enter that, that's no longer sacred. That that temple is, is, is tainted. So it's just like, you can't expect to have something so pure, but still, oh, do this, do that, you know, whatever. It wasn't that serious or whatever the case may be. It might not have been that serious, but that's just something oh. that always goes through my head when people say, oh, when and I hear I, y'all talk about, like, too. their temple and that's something you should keep sacred. Like, you should you should I, feel more about that, which I agree. Like, you shouldn't let anybody listen, just, because I, I feel like you just give off a lot of stuff. Listen, 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 listen. Yeah. For one, just because my Petey Bird being in this temple that don't mean it's dirty because it done been in that temple. <laughs> okay, well, just because some entered the temple don't mean it's tainted. What you, t- what you, okay, t- what, what? Wait, wait, then on top of that, let me go back to Ashton. She talking about. <laughs> I made up the used tire shit. Used. <laughs> I knew it. I knew it. I knew it was the used tire shit. Well, okay. I missed that. I heard her say used tire, but I look, didn't get look, what that was. You ain't because you talk the same thing what you saying about the temple and all this other stuff. So look, you, you could have even call me the motor or something. You call me the, <laughs> use the reason tire. the reason why you are used tire is because we need it in order to get the way we're going. We're not spending I'm not spending oh, too much yeah. on it. I'm yeah. not spending too but much I, on I just, it. But I just want to say I don't like, you know, I understand, you know, I don't really understand. I, I, I'm gonna take that. I do understand when guys like they oh, you know, that, that hurts if we, you know, you talking to somebody, not talking to somebody else, you start having sex with somebody and you don't gave, gave your, your coon noodle away, your box away, like that, that, like, nah, I don't want it no more. But I feel like, dang, like, we feel the same way, like, we don't, we don't want y'all to be out here fucking this person, that person, this person, that person, like, that, that affects us as well, like, we feel like, well, dang, he could just be out there just doing it to anybody, like, he must don't think that much of my coon noodle if that's the case, like, 
Like, as if you thought it was so sacred and you thought it was so this and so that, like, you would treat it as such. No, yeah, because you're not treating it as such. How can you even say, like, oh, I view it as this sacred place? If you already just feel it. I'm not going to give a pass to to things of that nature when it happens. Like, if you're just out of here slanging Peter Bird every way and then looking for, you know, like, you can't give a nigga a pass for that. That ain't cool. That ain't right. No way from a fest. Do you niggas, know. it is true, but, like, it's not right. But at the same think, time. I was going to say, you know, Whitney, because I've heard the same guy say, like, you know, sacred, like, he wants something that hasn't Girl. been. They, they love to say something about sacred. At the that same time, that's y'all act like I got to wait 90 days for it. It better be the same. <laughs> Holy or something special. Better, <laughs> but I got to wait 90 days for it. For what? <laughs> <laughs> that, Go ahead, you, Courtney. What you were saying, Courtney? I was saying the same guy who will say, like, I want to, you know, something sacred that not everyone's been in will, will be the same guy to also say pussy doesn't have a face, meaning he'll fucking. Mm. So that's. Well, I think that's that falls on us, though. That falls on us women. Like, I, I think that's when we take that time to, to decide whether or not if we gonna purchase uh, DG said refurbished, we re, we purchase some refurbished materials or are we gonna purchase some brand new shit, you know? Um, it's, it's all up to you as the woman and it's up to the man whether or not he choose to pursue, because like he was saying with his um, analogy earlier about going to the car lot and he see five people standing around five men standing around that car he's just gonna be like you know what I'm, I'm cool on that you know um that's just the same thing with us women we may see you at the bar or whatever and we see five women standing around you and be like you know i'm cool on that you know it's it's all your personal choice and decision you don't have to let him in the temple and he ain't got to go in it but you know a lot well i ain't, we, we we could talk about purchasing tickets to the temple we could talk about uh, how you feel about that, you know. Uh, yeah, like women, women out here selling what you call it, coop new. <laughs> yeah, women selling tickets to, to, to see they coop new, like cash yeah. out, cash outs. The where you think the forty dollars shit come from? Like people are selling my, tickets. I can go to my browser and type in bubblebutts.com. Hey, listen, we talked about porn. I, I, I you know, I mean, we. Oh, I, I was definitely tuned out, so I don't even know what we talking about. <laughs> we talked about porn before. We, we had a, a, a topic about, remember when we was talking about, um, is cheating, uh, do you consider watching porn cheating? I yeah. got to wait 90 days for something. You pay, You let people pay $10 to see. <laughs> Were well, you talking about porn on porn? Like, on, it's a no. way of it. Like, oh, because okay. remember what he's talking about, basically having sex with a female. You know, um, some women are selling ass. You know, um, via Cash App, you know. But anyway, um, what the Ebony? <laughs> what? Mm. Oily <laughs> <talking about the laughs> Ebony. <laughs> but what anyway, um, <laughs> but anyway, so we we could go on and on. We have a lot to talk about, but um, against this uh, male and female stuff. Um, this episode ever. But if you would like to open up a platform. Sean, you know, uh, we're more than welcome to be special guests on your show. He ain't opening up no platform. That platform I mean, is, he, he is swamp is when he's going it live, is, people it are is swamp territory. It is swamp territory. It ain't no special guests on that thing. I can't look. I told you, remember when we was talking before, you was like, Well, have y'all like talked about anything or like, did he like see your comments? I said, I can drop a comment. That thing gonna be ready. It's too many people. <laughs> also, you don't let people join your live. Yeah, it gotta not not. No, I don't. Uh, I but it's his. It's his. It's him. He can do whatever he wants. Well, he can. Yeah. But if I know you want to chime in or something like, <laughs> but but I run the show over there. Absolutely. No, nah, I'm just joking. But like, no, I'm sure. No, you do. He the director, right. That's right. <laughs> the manager, the the lights, you know, camera action, like, like me. It is because it is it is your area. Like, yeah, you know. Yeah. And you can tune in if you want to a one man band. Like, hey, I mean, it is what it is. You drop your comment if he read it, he read Y'all, it. Y'all, he kind of, he kind of. Like, I can't say like I feel like he he was very respectful like during this this podcast because like I'm telling you like on his on his page on his live he be turning it up like even his whole demeanor he'd be like <laughs> I just be like 
I don't, it's so different seeing him on live and just like like, like this in this atmosphere, like having a, a having a regular conversation because it's just like like right now it's just like we're all just like conversing and we're all just talking. But when he be on that line, <laughs> that yeah. man be turned up. <laughs> wow. Well, y'all got me bent though. <laughs> well, I gotta go. I got me too, y'all. I got shit to do. But um, right. thank thank.